Hey there, it's Daniel from thegoodax.com, where you can get free Google Docs templates and guides. Today, we are creating a blog quote on Google Docs and overview another indentation and line spacing options. The point of formatting a quotation as a blog quote is to make it stand out from other data on the page that we do by increasing its indent and applying formatting different from the regular text. Like using italic font and decreasing its size, another line spacing and etc. To mention, some academic writing styles have certain rules for formatting a block quote, like with MLA and APA, that require 0.5 inches indent from the left margin and having double spacing between lines. So, make sure to check those guidelines in your case. Now, let's quickly make a block quote. Here's the paragraph between the others that I want to format as a block quote. So, first, I select it. And then go into Format on a toolbar. Third line with Align and Indent. And then, Increase Indent over here. And there you have it. Or, you can do the same with this icon on the toolbar with this little arrow to the right and lines. And there you go. Or you do it with the tab button on a keyboard. And if you do that frequently, I think it's a good idea to keep in mind a shortcut for that, which is Ctrl plus square closing bracket. It's this one. And Command plus the same bracket for Mac. And what's nice, the default indentation is 0.5 inches, which is used in the most cases. But you can change that with the ruler on top of the document. And if you don't have it, go to View on the toolbar and click on Show Ruler. Highlight the text and go to this triangle on the ruler. Now move it left or right to change the indent of the selected paragraph. And on top here, it shows how far you moved it from the zero point. And finally, many writing styles require the block quote to have another spacing double spacing commonly, or other ones. And to make that, highlight the quote paragraph. Then click on this item on the toolbar and press double. Here you have it. And you can take it even further and set a custom spacing. Make sure the paragraph is selected. Go to the same icon on the toolbar, but now click on custom spacing. And here, in the first field, you can enter any number and change the line spacing inch by inch and then just hit apply to finish. Hundreds more guides and a lot of free Google Docs templates on thegoodax.com following the link below the video. Like to help share our videos to more people and subscribe to see more guides. I hope we helped you. Thank you for watching.